viewers, we now specifically take on air pollution, which occurs when harmful or excessive quantities of substances are introduced into the Earth's atmosphere. Sources of air pollution include gases such as ammonia, carbon monoxide, sulfur dioxide, nitrous oxide, methane, and chlorofluorocarbons. Particulates, both organic and inorganic, and biological molecules. Air pollution may cause allergies, diseases, and even death to humans. It may also cause harm to other living organisms such as animals and food crops and also damage the environment. Both human activities and natural processes can cause air pollution. Air pollution is a significant risk factor for a number of pollution-related diseases. These include respiratory infections, heart disease, COPD, stroke, and lung cancer. Poor air quality principally affects the body's respiratory system and the cardiovascular system. Outdoor air pollution alone causes 4.2 million deaths annually. Overall, air pollution causes 7 million deaths annually. It is the world's largest single environmental health risk. Furthermore, productivity losses and degraded quality of life caused by air pollution are estimated to cost the world economy $5 trillion annually. Human activities that are a major source of outdoor pollution include fuel combustion from motor vehicles, heat and power generation plants, industrial facilities, municipal and agricultural waste incineration plants, domestic heating, cooking and lighting with polluting fuels. Although air pollution originates from both anthropogenic and natural sources, the contribution from anthropogenic sources far exceeds that from natural sources. Smoke hanging over cities has become an everyday problem for many cities around the world. Smog can really be extremely thick. For instance, people who live very close to the Himalayas in India could see the Himalayas for the first time complete with the ice-covered caps some for the first time in their lives because the smoke had cleared due to the lockdown as a result of fighting the coronavirus pandemic. Although most emissions of air pollution are from local or regional sources, under certain atmospheric conditions, pollution can travel across borders and even across continents affecting people on those continents.